Yo, what's good, family? It's your boy JB Trap House Boxing. I'm back, back again with another one, man. So, <clears throat> anyway, I want to talk about this fraud, man, Manny Pacquiao. You know, Manny Pacquiao is, is full of shit, and I don't see how he, these diehard Manny Pacquiao fans even follow up with the bullshit he even be conjuring up. You know, this motherfucker finna get ready to fight. Over there in Australia, he's gonna fight Jeff Horn, and he all over there in interviews talking about Floyd Mayweather. <laughs> like, dude, that was what three fights ago. You know, you still harping on that shit that that nobody in the world believes that you won, but you and Bob Aaron, and he don't even really believe that because he just won a paycheck, just like you. You know you fucking lost, dude, and your and your shoulder wasn't hurt. You know, you trying to get this this big payday, and 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 wiggle and squeeze your way out. But okay, you wanted that bad. Get in the, get in the mix with these with these with these little young hungry lions and mix it up with these boys. They will give you a good payday. They might even pay your way out, out, out the motherfucking boxing uh, world. They make sure you get paid. Go ahead and get your good ass with them while you're getting paid. You still marketable. You still got the name. You know, you can take two more L's. One, one you know, it may hurt you. It's going to hurt you a little bit. Two of them, they're going to be like, yeah, you need to get up out of there. Go ahead and take them two last whoopings, man, and, and be done. You know, you can get you a good payday if you fight Mikey Garcia and fight like a Thurman or, or, or Earl, well, I don't even want to say Earl Spencer, Earl Spencer will kill this guy. I wouldn't even want to see Earl Spencer fight Manny Pacquiao. I think that would just be too much. I think Earl Spencer would just walk right through him and I think I think he'd just get, get him out of there no more than five rounds, it'd be over with. But yeah, you you got other Danny Garcia, Sean Porter, Kel Brook. Get in there, mix it up with these guys. Floyd ain't from the Floyd ain't giving you no rematch. You was talking all that shit about how he was the devil. Hey, how you doing? And you know, et cetera. But now you want some of the devil's money. I'm, I'm I'm confused. You, you weren't saying that the first time you got the big payday, but now you need him. After you done piggybacked off his name the whole your whole career, now you need Floyd again. I wouldn't even get if I was Floyd. I wouldn't get his chump no rematch. After all the, the the excuses and bad sportsmanship and all that that shit, he done pulled. I, I wouldn't give him no rematch. I make him get it like Drake, get it the hard way, get him blood. Yeah, but this motherfucking Manny Pacquiao is a fraud, man. A real deal fraud, and I'm sick of this clown, man. He needed, he just needed to just get a belt up, man, and get out the way. You can fight now. You can fight guys. You know, just get a belt up. Ain't nobody. If you get a belt up, ain't nobody even gonna be on your neck so tough. But now that you still got that belt, everybody's still on your on your back. Cause you in a way you holding up shit. You ain't trying to fight none of these boys. Get up. They gon' they willing to fight each other. Get that belt up, man. Just just step, son. Just just move. But. I'm not finna waste no more time and uh, talking about this fraud, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this fraud, this clown, man. He full of shit. He's the biggest liar. One of the biggest liars I've seen. Not even in the sport of boxing, just in on, on, in the world. Period. He full of shit, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this fraud, man. Holler.